Florida State won the toss and deferred. Here's this high-powered offense, but Bobby Bowden has said, I want him on defense first. Freshman to kick it off, Bentley, Damon Benning, and Corey Dixon are deep. Beautiful kick by the freshman that sends uh, Dixon into the end zone. He was the Huskers' most viable player in last year's Orange Bowl. His supporting cast, Calvin Jones, second to Mike Rozier in all-time rushing for the Huskers. He's only a junior. Schlesinger's the blocker. Dixon and Muhammad, the short, small, speedy wide receivers. Gerald Armstrong, the tight end. For Nebraska on the front line, they're huge. Almost 300-pound average. Lundberg, Zadika, Graham, Malin, and Weger, three of the five, all big eight. They'll outsize Florida State. Can they outquick him? Jones, and there's an early hint. Loses a yard. He's joined by John Nance, Derek Alexander in the front three, Roberson, Ken Alexander, not related, Rebull and Brooks, one of the All-Americans at safety, is uh, Bush and Coase with Sawyer and Abraham, speedy NFL-type corners. They can cover man. Second 11, Frazier on the toss. Jones got some running room. And he's cartwheeled at the 27-yard line, third and four. Frazier rolling. He's a good runner. And he has the first down and five yards more to the 35-yard line. Deep line of scrimmage, Dick. Keeps it himself. And then slips at the 39. That's twice that a Husker runner. Big eight, they play on the artificial carpet. The only game this season was at UCLA's Rose Bowl on the grass. And this is Jones straight ahead. And that uh, young Tommy Frazier looks at a third and four. The toss to Jones. Looking for a block. And is able to squeak along the sideline. Byron Bennett to punt. James Colsey is back. Oh, it's Corey Sawyer. Sawyer at the 19-yard line. Charlie Ward, the quarterback. Sean Jackson and William Floyd, the runners. Matt Fryer, Kez McCorvey, Kevin Knox, the wide receivers in this fast break offense. Loriano, Tyre, Shiver, McNeil, and Farrell, the offensive line. And he's underneath center, which is also very unusual for Charlie Ward. He hands off. His runner is Sean Jackson, and Nebraska was ready. Look. Second and ten. The give inside and hit in the backfield is Jackson. Dante Jones, Kevin Raymakers, Terry Keneally. Up front, although Alberts plays right on the line of scrimmage. Stuart Anderson and Beeler, the linebackers. Miles, the best cover man. And Tyrone Williams, who went to high school with Frazier up north in Bradenton. And right and high formation. Floyd and Jackson behind him. It's Ward's first pass. He gets away from Alberts and now scrambles. And it's out to the 27-yard line, shy of the first down. St. Petersburg, average year punting, under 40-yard average. And he hits an end-over-end -end line drive that is mishandled a bit. And finally, Kareem Moss is smothered in a sea of white jerseys. A time with the ball, six runs, no passes. A yard at best left in this formation. With only Jones in the backfield, he gets the toss. And another one-yard pickup. So from the shotgun, Fraser to Jones, who staggers and takes a loss at the 22. Short kick. Fair catch, but it bounces and takes a Florida State bounce down at midfield. I don't understand that. From the 49 in Nebraska, Charlie Ward throws into the flat. Matt Fryer, and Fryer out of bounds. Give up a series in a national championship game to see what the <laughs> opponent's going to do later on. Second and two for Ward. He fires incomplete. And the first flag of the day, and it's offside against Nebraska. That will give Florida State a first down. And tackles led them in sacks with 15. On first down, Ward. A quick trigger, and it's complete. Kez McCorvey to the Nebraska 25. You're just one-on-one -on -one with the next tackler, and Florida State back to the line of scrimmage. Dead ball, ball start on the offense. Five-yard penalty. In those days, and he has produced everything but the national title. 
First and 15 for Ward. Wide open, McCarvey, and it'll be first and goal. The second all-time to Ron Sellers in Florida State history. Ward turns and throws back to William Floyd, and that one goes awry as Ed Stewart. First, Charlie Ward, and he is a terrific talent. Leads Florida State in touchdowns with 10. Ward under pressure, and down he goes at the 30. A rare sack of Charlie Ward. Pressure, but Alberts nails him for a 10-yard loss, so it is third down and long. We have to get to the one for a first down, and Ward throws toward the end zone, and no one there, but a... No flag, no flag. He is a 47-yarder, would match his longest of the year. And he hooks it. Plenty of wind behind him, but he's wide to the left. So Bentley is now only two for eight, over 30 yards. Now Frazier gets hurt, his turn. Best starting position for Nebraska, their third position at the 30 after the missed field goal. And Frazier, his second pass, incomplete. The one completed pass was for minus seven yards, remember, to Calvin Jones, who takes the handoff, has some blocking. And Jones, third down, and a long one. And Frazier will take it himself for a first down to the 44. 40 yards now for Nebraska, number three in the nation in rushing this season. Play action again by Frazier. Lots of time, flag down, and he throws incomplete. The legal formation, Nebraska only had six men on the line of scrimmage. And a tie would have sealed the national championship, but he went for the victory, lost the national title. Down on the slip is Frazier again. Third and uh, 13. Good protection for Frazier. It's deflected, and Corey Dixon cannot come up with it. Another very short kick into the win. It takes a Husker roll. And will die inside the 25. Ward out of the shotgun with Sean Jackson. He throws to Jackson. Incomplete. Coleman at linebacker along with Lorenzo Brinkley. This one is incomplete. And the slot is McCorby, his favorite target. He throws this one long for Vanover. Too long and too wide out of bounds. He released the ball. Sean Liss. And over and Corey Dixon. Has some running room. 35, 40. He's in the open. 50. Two men to beat. Got a blocker. 30. Corey Dixon down the sidelines. Cuts back. Touchdown to a flag is down. Hold on. A flag is down back at the 33 Husker territory. Pushing it back above the waist. 10 yard penalty. Nebraska's ball, first and 10. In there. Fraser hit before he can deliver the snap. He was trying to toss, and Todrick McIntosh, 94. Quarterback draw, and uh, Frazier saw something he liked and charges across the 30 to the 32. And that will be the end of the opening quarter. And if uh, you're a Nebraska fan, the score won't be disappointing for Florida State, averaging 43 a game. Uh huh. That's the end of the we open the second quarter, no score. Nebraska with a ball, third down and two across their own 31 yard line. Tommy Frazier, the sophomore. Play action. And he's got a man wide open. Abdul Muhammad, a first down at the 45. Los Angeles. First down, the toss to Jones. Throw. Yes, he is throwing long for Muhammad. And it's broken up on a big hit by Richard Coase. Second and 10. Frazier and the Huskers at thrown 45. Calvin Jones. Well done by the Florida State defense. Frazier completed less than 50% of his passes and uh, tries to run. Caught from behind by Derek Alexander. What a half this sophomore has had for Florida State. <laughs> the win. And it makes a difference. A huge spiral that Sawyer's going to let bounce. And Nebraska did not cover behind the... Not giving it to Floyd, the fullback yet. They go to Sean Jackson, and a yard is all they can muster. Fire right, knocks left. The protection, Ward up on top. And what a catch by Knox at the Nebraska 49. 
And we got the horses to get it done. Johnny Johnson, the tight end, 85, and on the right side, Ward to the sidelines and Vanover. Which and it's Sean Jackson hit by Christian Peter. A score, 11:39 left in the opening half. There's Floyd, the fullback, and uh, he rumbles. Second and six. Ward under center. Gives to Jackson. Oh, my. What a defense. He's out of the shotgun. Expecting blitz. The pump. Now the throw. Oh, that'll be interference on John Reese. Well, it's such a threat to run. On the defense, 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. Stay first down at the 19. Lots of time. Then to the sidelines. And the Matt Fryer. Freshman Ward Dunn at tailback. Tight end Johnson on the right side. And here's Young Dunn. He's lightning quick. Eight and a half minutes before the intermission. Still no score. Big third and three. Here come the Huskers, all out blitz. The throw incomplete to Fryer. There is no play. There is no play. It's a delay of game before the snap. Two wide receivers and showing blitz. Nebraska again. And Ward, they pick up the blitz and Ward to the end zone. No one there. Well, the backup quarterback to hold. It's a 34 yard attempt into the win. And it is gone. Florida State. On the board first at the midpoint of the second quarter. The battle for number one, Florida State three, Nebraska nothing. To the game. I return to move Dixon at the nine. That's an avenue. And out across the 35-yard line. With 7.48 left in the half. Messenger and Calvin Jones behind Frazier. Jones. The guy has speed to get around the corner. Base man. Tied with Ford at seven in the first half. Frazier. Handing off inside uh, for X-rays. Cluster Johnson in motion and Frazier in trouble. Able to elude the rush. And throw the ball to Dixon. Incomplete. He was out of bounds when he threw it. And he threw it to a receiver out of bounds. Third down, 17. Ball to the left. Johnson in the slot. The throw is to Johnson. Has some running room. 50, 45, a first down, and much more to the Florida State 35-yard line. Nebraska's deepest drive to the Florida State 35, trailing 3-0. Calvin Jones. Oh, just one. Damon Benning, a sophomore from Omaha, who played for Jones when he was injured earlier in this year. Frazier guns it into a crowd. Oh, it goes on the deflection to Reggie Ball. Touchdown, Nebraska. <laughs> Reggie Ball, a sophomore from Bellevue, Nebraska, did not catch a touchdown all season long. And on Ball in the right place to give the underdog Huskers the lead. And drives it through. 64 yards in sixth place for the Huskers. It took them less than two minutes. 34 yards on the touchdown to a man who didn't catch a pass. Credit. Surprising in that no one really stopped Florida State, not even Notre Dame. Defeat of this Knowles. This is Vanover, very dangerous. And he's out across the 30 to the 35 and pushed out to the 38-yard line. Under center is Charlie Ward. Play action. And hit from behind by Alberts. The second sack. And to Ward's credit, no fumble. Second and one for Ward and action before the snap. Dead ball foul. Ball start on the offense. 6'4", says he weighs 235 now. There's an All-State basketball player as well in Iowa. Draw play to Sean Jackson, and look at that flying of Lorenzo Brinkley. Third down and 26 for Ward. Looking for a big gainer, and he is behind his receiver. 
Not a very good kick by Sean Liss. Dixon lets it bounce, and it bounces back toward Florida State's goal, starting at the Florida State 45. And Florida State showing blitz. Calvin Jones behind Fraser. He keeps it himself for about three. Quarter pound sophomore Fraser. Reverse to Dixon. Well read by Florida State. Dixon did a good job of getting around the corner, but he got break. Holding. Offense. 10 yard penalty. Still second down. And a second and long for Fraser. Think somebody would be open, wouldn't you? And uh, Fraser can't find him. 7 3 Nebraska, 249 left in the half. Play action by Fraser. Has Dixon. Is he inbounds? No. And his dive, he couldn't get his feet down. Sawyer led the ACC in interceptions with six. Calls for the fair catch at the 21. Warwick Dunn in the backfield with Ward. Ward to the far sidelines, wide open. Kez McCorvey. The screen to Dunn. Knocked down by 223 left in the hand. Ward gets away. 50. 40. Out of bounds at the 35. This is an athlete who likes the Roger Stylock, Steve Young. Same effort, and just by a heel, Ward to the sidelines and wide open is that over, and it's going to be for roughing Ward. That's Raymaker 67. Looked a little iffy. Ward, oh, through the hands of McCorvey. Done in motion. And they throw underneath of Vanover and looking for Dunn on this side. Gets away again. To the sidelines and oh, that could almost, almost have been grounding, intentionally grounding the ball, but well, this will be a 24-yard attempt. Canell, the second string quarterback, the holder, if it should be a fake, but it's Bentley. Driving it through to make it a one-point game. Two. Two field goals by Florida State in this first half. Officially 25 yards. Nebraska leads seven to six with 22 seconds remaining. Hunters the other night, uh, one of the highlights of this holiday season. A floater hit by Bentley. And taken by Damon Benning. And look at him move. Oh, what a return to the 47. Is Fraser has time for a couple of plays. Some passes. Try to stop the clock. Maybe a field goal attempt. Drills this one. Is it complete? No. And Ferrantis, our producer tonight from the Federal Express Orange Bowl. Fraser. Last play now of this half. Throws across field where it is intercepted. Clifton Abraham, who had uh, one interception on the year, picks it off, and so ends this first half. The score is surprising. Nebraska, the Big Red, the underdogs, unbeaten, lead Florida State 7-6. to six. Kicking off this time, Sealer. Very high and short, and it's to Riley. The sophomore from Orlando gets outside. Williams by the shirt tail. Finally wrestles him out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. And into the gun they go. Absolutely. Ward throwing and Tyrone Williams over the bat to find receivers in the middle of the field. And second down. There it is. Middle of the field. Vanover. That'll be close to a first down. Ward, oh, through the hands of Knox, but without a national title. Trailing 7-6, second and 10. Oh, what a catch. Pulled in by Matt Fryer. That'll work as well, that's what we him summer. <laughs> Ward on top and going long. Caught at the five-yard line by Kevin Knox. 
First and goal from the five. The give is to William Floyd, and the fullback is near the goal line. They still haven't blown a dead. No, he's marked. They're not going to give him the touchdown. An official marked him just outside the end zone. Floyd will keep it himself. No, Floyd. Loses the ball, and Nebraska recovers. Was he in? No, they say touchdown. He'd broken the play. Mike Anderson fell on the ball, but Floyd had broken the plane. Touchdown, Florida State. Three back set, good push and shove. Floyd gets up in the air, and Dickey really didn't need to. Florida State takes the lead, and now they go for two, leading 12 to 7. Ward. Incomplete. A beautiful defensive play by Toby Wright. National championship and that extra point. Same spot in the field. Yep. Turner Gill to Jeff Smith. He but wanted to play the second half. We'll see. High kick that gets away from Benning. Now Benning in trouble. And a smother just outside the 10. Florida State brings Aitman on the line of scrimmage. And the give is to Damon Benning. So second down and five. A reverse to Dixon. Oh, he had blockers out there, but a fine defensive play. Reggie Ball, the touchdown maker, way out to the left. Jermaine Bell, second tight end, shifts to the left. On third and a short three. Frazier, complete to Bell. And he's out to the 35 and a first down. Dixon split out to the near side. And it's Benning. Back to the 40. USC, was it? The toss to Benning. And he is collared. Third and six. Frazier. Incomplete and no penalty. Bush was all over the back of Reggie Ball. Oh, Corey Sawyer back. High wobbly kick. Sawyer with a fair catch at the 26-yard line. Gained the lead. And now Ward back to work from the shotgun. Reflected and incomplete. Protect Charlie Ward as best they can. On the run, caught by Vanover as a high school senior in the country. A third down, and it's Alberts again. Trev Alberts' third sack of the game. And that is just underlined. Hold and away. Played in UCLA this year. No flag. What a kick by Liss against the win. Dixon finally corrals it at the 15. Oh, he had the wall on the right side, but not for that tackle by Chris Cowart. Trailing 12 to 7 and feels in the fourth quarter. If they're close, they can come from behind. Frazier just eludes the rush. Throws. What a catch out at the 36-yard line. Damon Benning, the freshman playing for the injured Calvin Jones. It's Benning running into a wall. And now the other way, one man to beat, but he can't get away from Clifton Abraham. 96 yards. Cross to Benning. Has a blocker. Oh, the big throws in a hurry up from the secondary bush and throws. That they have. He's number one. That's to Dixon, a little flanker screen. Breaks some tackles, but not enough for a first down. At the 25. Oh, almost blocked. A beautiful spiral. Fair catch called by the backpedaling Sawyer at about the 12, maybe the 11 Lee Ward out of the gun. Under pressure, throws long, and well covered Tyrone Williams. Going to catch that man-on-man -man receiver down there. William Floyd, the fullback, and he is a load. Look at him breaking tackles down the clear at the 30, and caught from behind by Mike Anderson. So William Floyd, 36 yards in the play. Well, that's the big running play of the game for Ward and uh, Florida State. Now Knox wrestled down by Darren Miles. Goose. Ward guns, and it's Fry. Fryer out of bounds at the 32, where the ball was thrown, and another late hit against Nebraska. There have been some big penalties tonight against Nebraska. That's a pretty obvious one. Those were the... That is unusual. Ward, after 
for the penalty. Right into the arms of 86 Wayne Harris. Whoops. Red ball. Ball start on the offense. He'll be second down. Things you will learn with a couple of farm guys. Ward throws underneath the Fryer. And Fryer tackled at the 23. The light to be around. Ritz. And uh, Ward throws. Oh, the end zone and no catch. He was out of the field of play. This one from 39 yards. And he hits this a ton. Bentley, who had only two from over 30 all season, has two tonight. And the Seminoles up their lead to 15 to 7. Breath. Dan Mowry. It's a sidewinder for Dixon, who has been tough on return. Looking for a hole, but it closes in a hurry at the 15 yard line. Offsides on the kickers. With some 18 point underdogs as the AFC champions and beat the Colts in Don Field. So they re kick it, and Dixon from the six behind the wedge. And it accelerates to the 27 yard line. They're trailing by eight. Nebraska with the ball. Frazier's toss. Goes to Lawrence Phillips. And the true freshman is to the 29-yard line. Here's Frazier on the quarterback draw. The University of Nebraska. Oops. And the flag goes down. One of those moving. And Lumpy is the other. We'll tackle Lance Lundberg. A couple of 300-pounders. Frazier. Plants and hits Dixon. First down at the 45 46. I'm going to be like Doug Williams. I'm going to be a black quarterback and win a Super Bowl someday. Trying to win something pretty big here today, and he's short on this throw. A carrier in Nebraska history, only a junior, but he's out. And there's Lawrence Phillips through a big hole. And the true freshman from California, this uh, freshman from Southern California, has his biggest game of the night. The fake reverse, and now Frazier throwing to Dixon, who's open, and catches it. A juggling catch and a tackle at the 12. That is the end of three for the national championship. Florida State, 15. Nebraska, 7. We'll be right back after these messages from your local station. But Nebraska driving their deepest position inside uh, the 20-yard line. And Tommy Frazier sets him up at the 13. Give to Phillips. And the freshman is a touchdown! Officially 12 yards, and Phillips, who is the quickest and fastest of the talented core of tailbacks or eyebacks at Nebraska, is the call here. Buster Johnson in motion. Frazier. He had a man open in the end zone, but didn't throw it. Knocked out of bounds at the one by Ken Alexander. But lead by only two as Nebraska has marched 73 yards in seven convincing plays. The final 12 by Lawrence Phillips. Wants to be out there fly fishing. The kick to Phillip Riley. Riley gets a nice block. And to the 20 to 25 yard line. Based on the Irish victory earlier, would be the national title. Ward gives to Floyd, and that big fullback is tough to bring down. He's in tingly when you get hit. <laughs> so, well, I guess. <laughs> Ward out the outside, and it's McCorvey working the sidelines, and a first down. Floyd. And this time, chopped down, and there to go. Second down and eight. Ward hit as he throws and oh. it was Kez McCarthy. There's a change tonight for Florida State. Ward needs eight for a first down and he starts to run then throws. What a catch with a flag down. Holding defense. The pass is complete. The penalty is declined. When you're watching a national football league right. team. On the run, Ward and another catch at the 45 of Nebraska. Tested all night long is out, and Kareem Moss 
A junior has replaced him at the corner. Ward buying some time and now throws it up for grabs. Oh my. Hit for the NCAA basketball tournament last year. With third down and four. And this one, one of the few tonight that hasn't been close to anyone. Would have to defend Charlie to death. Leave him alone. He's all right. What a high boomer by Sean Liss that hits him. Let's go. And not saved. It was hit by two Seminoles for this national championship. And it's the Huskers with the ball at the 20. And Lawrence Phillips, who was the star in the last series, is into the secondary again and picks up a dozen. California, UCLA territory. Side handoff and after the 39 yard line, Jeff Makovica. Second down and a long five for Frazier. Got some blockers. Great fake on the pitch, and they had to respect Phillips the way he runs. The offensive line. And uh, as one said, keep it close to the fourth period. That's where we've played our best football. It makes sense. Breeze has died down. 10 24 left in the game. Fraser on second down to Phillips on the handoff, and the freshman gets to the 44. Matt. Caught and tackled immediately was Cluster Johnson. The first down, a little more from field goal range, trailing by two. Fraser passing on first down. He scores on that one to Trumaine Bell. Who has a first down at the Florida State 24. Working on this New Year's Day. And this developing into one of the memorable games as Lawrence Phillips looking for a block. And he is hit well on the outside. But second down and eight. Draw to Phillips. And no place to go. Gary Alexander right now at the 24. This would be a 41-yard field goal. And there's flags down as Frazier is inside the 15 to the... Dead ball. Ball start. Oh. Offensive line. Beat the center snap. Shot down. Good protection. Intercepted. Picked off by Richard Coase. And Coase finally knocked down at the 30-yard line, and a flag goes down. Of significance. Walking back, above the waist, on the receiver after the interception. So that will Florida come back State from the 30. After... And that's what he does. And hit in the backfield is Sean Jackson. Florida State has not given up the ball the entire night. And there's... Stand over on the sideline of McCorvey, rather one he's completed tonight. Now third and seven. And the throw on this side is caught inside the 30. Let's see where they mark it at the 29. Not enough for the first down. So Sean lists the punt. It comes to Kareem Moss. And Moss goes down, and so does the yellow flag. And it to the 20 they'd be within reasonable field goal range for Byron Bennett his success not great six out of 11 on the year but uh, that's getting ahead of ourselves Frazier to Phillips Phillips outside Phillips still on his feet and he's to the 37 yard line fumbles but was down at playing only in the second half he leads all rushers with 065 Phillips again fumbles and it appeared that one of the linemen downfield, yes. Frazier to Quester Johnson, and he goes down. He catches. He does catch it. Well, I don't or think he has he? control. No, he never has Never pulled it in. It. That should have been incomplete. But Three minutes and five seconds left. There's the draw by Frazier. Runs up the back of those big linemen to the 40 of Florida State. Will that happen? That Bowden has lost national championship when his own kicker is missed to be beaten by the field goal. Frazier, keeper. 35 has blockers. One man to beat at the 20. He's at the 10 to the 9. And a flag down is the tackle made by Matt Knight. Schlesinger, 40. The fullback and blocking back. And the freshman, Phillips. It's Phillips on the toss, and oh, is he upended. What a hit. 
Second and goal. Clock continues to run. One and a half left. Phillips runs up the back of his blockers. Nothing there. Phillips, whose fumble was recovered by Zach Wigert. Otherwise, Florida State would have the ball. And it's Phillips who gets the handoff. And down he goes with a loss. John Nance, 27 yards. How big for this 23-year-old senior? It's good. going to go out of bounds. A flag is down. Out of bounds. That'll be in the 35-yard line for 34 in the near side. Fred Alberts. He has three sacks so far tonight. Ward throws it up. Oh, Corby in the slot. And uh, Ward done in the backfield. The little guy from Baton Rouge. And they throw to him. And he's dangerous in the open field. And he's smart enough to get out of bounds. It's to two from outside the 30 with two this evening. Knocked away by Tyrone Williams. Intended for Kevin Knox, and that'll bring up fourth and a long one. The state in this situation. The give to Floyd, and he just does cross the 45. And they wind it up, and Florida State used only uh, three or four seconds. Now Ward in the open field to Dunn. Anderson can't get him, and Dunn is out of bounds, and a fly goes down. Oh, my. Oh, my. No, Nebraska, I believe, is going to be called for a personal foul. The dead ball, personal foul. Late hit out of bounds. He is. And throws almost a touchdown. I don't think Bobby wants it to be decided on a field goal. He didn't trust those things. Going toward the end zone. And there's the flag. Interference. 15 yards. 35 seconds to go. Give us to Sean Jackson. Jackson, who has not been able to clear the line of scrimmage, cover boy, choosing late to go to Florida State over Notre Dame for just this. He's got it. There's going to be a penalty here for the excessive celebration. Wanting to risk a turnover or a foil play. Give Nebraska too much time. We'll see. There's the line drive kick. It's a turnable. It sure is. Out to the 40. And out to the 44-yard line. Fraser goes long for Bell. Made a terrific catch. Ten seconds on the play clock. Eight seconds left in the game. Over the middle to Bell. And Bell tackled with one second to go. No. They didn't stop the clock soon enough. They, that should, uh, they should have a second left here. He was clearly down before the final zero went up. And the officials did not call it. Nosburn can't believe it. Dick, I agree with you totally. He was down. Clock should be stopped. There should be another play. There should have been time. And Osborne very calmly is pointing at the clock saying, seeing what we did, that 45 yards to steal it from Florida State and to give Cinderella, Nebraska, a tremendous win and a national championship. And he hooked it left. Florida State wins. for a national championship with only Notre Dame to beat.
After two wide rights for the Seminoles, Bowden agonizingly watches one go left.